the new ideogram just changed the game is it better than flux and mid journey folks today i'll show why ideogram 2.0 is outpacing giants like mid journey and flux in some areas can this new version really beat its rivals in realism and rendering plus is this accessible intuitive tool worth investing in we'll answer these questions and showcase the features making ideogram 2.0 a top choice for quality ai image generation stay tuned tuned to learn all this but first you know the drill comment below if you think this new ideogram 2.0 comma balancing realism and ease can outperform giants like mid journey and flux what's your preference user friendly or advanced customization i want to hear your thoughts don't forget to like and share this video link in whatsapp and telegram groups to keep your friends updated on this topic deal let's continue Today I'm talking about the new Ideogram 2.0 model that's set to shake up the AI image generation market. Spoiler alert, it's targeting giants like Mid Journey and the newly launched Flux and might surprise many. Stick around till the end to see why this new version is creating such a buzz. Ideogram 2.0 isn't just another update, it's packed with major improvements. We're looking at a huge leap in image generation, realism and accuracy. You know that AI that that's always been good but never got the spotlight it deserved? Well, it seems Ideogram is ready to change that perception for good. A key advancement is image realism, which will appeal to those who love creating hyper-realistic images. What's more, besides boosting realism, the tool offers new features and settings that streamline the creation process, whether for 3D rendering, anime-style characters, or graphics with detailed text. Now, to truly grasp what's happening, we need to examine the current landscape. In recent months, many innovations have emerged in the AI image generation market. Competition is fierce with players like Flux AI, Stable Diffusion XL, and AuraFlow. But Ideogram 2.0 isn't just here to compete, it aims to surpass them all. The company has made it clear that the new model excels in text image alignment, meaning generated images better match the prompts. Moreover, the new model is far more precise at rendering text within images, which has always challenged other AIs. Shall we discuss the key features that make Ideogram 2.0 stand out? Now you have five presets to choose your image style. Want something realistic like a photo? there's a preset for that creating a graphic design and need perfect text there's a specific preset for that too for 3d or anime fans there's something special the general preset is ideal for any project you have in mind these adjustments are useful if you don't want to spend hours tweaking prompts but that's not all Another cool feature is color palette control for precise image adjustments. Great for branding work to maintain color consistency. Now you have more control, ensuring images match your vision exactly. Speaking of realism, Ideogram 2.0 really stands out. Image textures are stunning with lifelike details. Skin and hair look incredibly realistic. This realism will appeal to those needing photo-like results without the time or skill to create from scratch. The model better understands prompt details ensuring images match exactly what you ask for. This new Ideogram model tackles a major issue. AI is not understanding our requests. With Ideogram 2.0, these problems seem to be on their way out. One standout feature is its text rendering capability. AI image users know adding text to images can be quite challenging. You input a simple phrase and AI spits out jumbled letters, but with this new model that rarely happens anymore. They've really improved how the system handles text making it a great option for those needing clear, readable text in images, be it for social media, design projects, or even something more fun. Ideogram has now also launched an iOS app. Android users, don't worry. They've confirmed your app is on the way too. Plus, there's a beta API available, so you can integrate Ideogram 2.0 tech directly into your projects. 
Better yet, the API pricing is competitive. Great news for those seeking high quality tools. Oh, and before I forget, they've also launched Ideogram Search. This feature lets you explore over 1 billion user generated images from the past year. If you ever lack inspiration, you now have a huge creative library to spark new ideas. Will this help a lot? What do you think? Comment below. Let's talk about using Ideogram 2.0. The free version lets you generate 20 images daily in batches of four. This is ideal for beginners or small projects. For more flexibility, paid plans start at $8 slash month offering more options and higher limits. For advanced users, the $1.20 slash month unlimited slow generation plan is interesting. Remember, these prices are current as of this video's recording date. Compared to rivals like Midjourney, Ideogram offers a more affordable option, but price isn't its only selling point. Ideogram 2.0's interface is super user-friendly, making it much easier for those who dislike complex prompts. They focus on simplicity without sacrificing quality, great for those who prefer creativity over technical details. But how does Ideogram 2.0 stack up against new models like Flux 1? Initial impressions and user feedback suggest Ideogram 2.0 is performing exceptionally well. Using the realism preset, image quality rivals Flux 1, which has been creating buzz lately. However, if customization is your priority, mid-journey still has a slight edge. However, Ideogram 2.0's color palette control and presets offer creative freedom without complex settings. But is Ideogram 2.0 really worth it? Absolutely. It's user-friendly, delivers high-quality results, and is more affordable. With improved realism, text rendering, and features like color control, it's a strong AI image generation contender. Plus, with the new iOS app, upcoming Android app, developer API, and search feature, it's a versatile tool for both professionals and beginners in the digital art world. Now, I want to hear from you. The big question. Do you think Ideogram's ease and lower cost outweigh the deeper customization of other platforms? I'm eager to hear your thoughts, so please leave a comment sharing your impressions on what we discussed. This video doesn't end here. It continues with our conversation in the comments. If you found this video interesting, please like, share, and subscribe.